Wait, wait, do you want to watch the, uh, the Arkosh match? Dude, I don't want to do that right now. Dude, you have energy right now. I, I really don't. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to this video where Newsham, Jason Newsham, and I are going to be taking a look at uh, one of Arkosh Gaming's replays where they picked uh, Sniper Pudge. This was a stolen strategy from us. And so we're going we're gonna to give it a gander here and see what's going on. So, of course... Uh, hmm. <laughs> I see Pudge has literally no items there, and uh, Sniper appears to have bought regen for him. Uh, nine tangos. <laughs> I forgot about this. I forgot that Arkosh did this. <laughs> I just... I can't believe they did this <laughs> on a DPC match. Zero items. Imagine losing to this. How depressed would you be if a pun shows up with zero items uh, and then you lose the lane? Can, I actually have a question. Can you go player perspective on their lane for the first like thirty seconds? Can you see if they click on Pudge? That's a good idea. I want to know. I want to know that they knew. Oh, they did. He's clear. He's clear. <laughs> He's <really> clear. <laughs> no, no, no. Denied. <laughs> He's clearly trying to ping it, but there's nothing there to ping. <laughs> he can't alt ping it. Oh, I see him. Man. Let's look. Let's move he's his mouse. He's clearly down. trying to ping. Slow, wait, wait. slow motion. This. I do slow want to slow mo this. So he clicks. He he he, he, he does he does like way. a double take. He clicks yeah. again. Oh, he clicks you. I mean <laughs> sniper. <laughs> he clicks sniper. It's just very easy to do on sniper, who still has nine tangos in <laughs> center. Wait. Crow, oh Crow sent out a mango? Are you serious? Yeah, I assume he did that because, I mean, we play this a lot, right? So, like, I, we know better. Like, uh, I'm assuming that the thought process was something like, if Pudge has no items, he just can't really sustain. Because, you know, once you throw out a few hooks, like, you just go out of mana. So, he's just really, yeah. really going with this whole, like, he's buying all the regen for... Of course, of course, and this does happen when we play this situation. Of course, Sniper being uh, not a position four, uh, does end up getting caught out here, probably saying, guys, I am going to be going down here soon. Very nice hook from Kremlo to save Crow, and uh, the turnaround. Oh my god, such a good bait. Such, such a, a good bait. bait, yeah. It's really obvious. Wow. And... Really well calculated, yeah. When they went over there to contest, I'm sure they were thinking about... Absolutely. You know, are we strong enough? I have this fairy fire, I have three branches. We can yeah. have some action. Of course. So I think that hook there probably, it's not funny, don't laugh. Very oh, wow, back up there? Back Good. That up? Yeah, okay. That you was want, really you want, you want to go watch uh, that again? Yeah, so Crow right here, as you can see, he's like pathing like all over. He's clearly trying to break that clarity there. But he does end up going taking it, <laughs> take it down look, there. Look at, the, look at this in slow motion. <laughs> She's like, oh, that was traumatizing, man. What a crazy fight. Oh, thank God I can clarity up. We can reset here. Oh, this will be good. Yeah, maybe I can get a self. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Come, comes in for a quick peep. So look at this. This is a classic debate, a classic pudge debate. What you do is you chase one guy down, you make it look like you're going for them, and then when the other idiot comes over to try and help, as you're faking the hooks, you, you can't. Pudge is so fat, you can't even see where he's actually hooking and so you can snipe people with this and and catch them off guard <laughs> oh that's just so pathetic god. oh god crow is such a pathetic loser filth it is honestly this looks as pathetic as our tuba tuba action it does, games. It does. i think honestly you have to just kind of steer into the chaos this uh canis vulpus character is can't can't oh, even wow, outlane a gentleman Jeez. this gentleman is not even a mid player on Picado Squad. Not even a mid player. Canis Vulpus is absolutely pathetic. Really? If you're watching this, Canis Vulpus, you're disgusting, and your grandmother thinks that you smell bad when you go over to her house. You smell like you smell like fish tacos all the time, and she won't tell you, but I'm telling you. Of course, Crow takes over the uh, laning because Pudge falls off and becomes pathetic quite quickly, and that sets up for the easy hook. Yeah, I think it's because they have the two shrapnel timing there. If you saw, they actually needed two to take her down. Yeah, they've they've definitely done this one in scrims, I think, which I'm sure yeah, they... Yeah, you can tell they practice this a lot. I, I'm sure they 
they do a lot of those. I'm I'm sure they just such chaotic heroes. Like they're just in their element, and uh, these people are clearly very confused on Dire. Let's get man, like another one. The headshot proc. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> was that the headshot setup? Let's see. All five out synergy, yeah. Yeah. Let's get of course, of course, the headshot. Uh, wait, what was that? Regard. Why is he laughing? Uh, I think that might have been a chat wheel. Let me scroll up. Oh, that's weird. No. There's no chat. He must have to be manually typing uh, slash laughing Wait a minute. in the chat. Do I, have, right? do, I have, or do I have crow blocked? No, no. I think he has to be manually typing that out. No, there's, abso uh, there's absolutely no way somebody would do that. That's, that's absurd. Yeah, I think it's still going. Yeah, he must be. It's that or he's typing like LOL or haha. -ha. <laughs> That's yeah. so stupid. Crow is TPing out. I'm sure Gremlo was very tempted to hook him, but he was probably very worried that Pale Horse would be very upset if uh, Gremlo was griefing in officials uh, instead of on tuba. So he didn't do it. Uh, we'll see what sort of stuff is going on down here. Really high impact stuff, it looks like. Yeah, this is. Just sort of walking around. This really is really good. good. Yeah. This is good. God, the, the the headshot proc set up for the Night Stalker too. Oh, I see he gets shoot. I, that's pathetic. But it's the thing is what you don't realize is blocking. So like, he can't right, go that like way. Right, like zoning shrapnel. I see. Right. Yeah. yeah, this is definitely a really good idea from from Gremlo. Uh, of course, uh, Gremlo is directly in front of the enemy tier two at fifty percent HP because Pudge is just complete filth. And uh, yeah, four getting... I think really. This is a uh, pro circuit match, right? This is DPC, yeah. This is DPC. I see. You just fell on oh, he's tipped. Yeah. What levels Venge again? Uh, Twenty Venge... seconds. <laughs> Not level four yet. I see. Very good. Radiance bottom tower That's is under attack. Yeah. Oh, nice. The draft comes into play here. You have the Kunka Lashrak opener. This is a classic. It's really easy and consistent. Obvious X marks. Yeah. Uh, really stun. great oh, stun from I Pale see. Horse. Very good Pale Horse. Yeah. That, that is why really they good. first phase that. And he just TPs out. Oh, there's... no stun? I see. Yeah. yeah. Literally nothing. We'd have like a 0.5 yeah. second window there to, to press it. And still, the uh, just running at the tower for literally no particular reason results in a decent hook into two men torn, which was nice from from goat uh, assassinate too yeah yeah the assassinate was really good sorry about that i i forgot to there's just so much good good action going on okay uh, grandma had a really obvious bait yeah that was really good tower, obviously so good. good yeah not chaotic it's really obvious what's going on here yeah I, i'm never using it they just slowly go down by the the melee range sniper here there's less travel time on the right clicks, and uh, you can get down those those headshots ASAP uh, as soon as possible. Is what that stands for. Man, these these Arkosh Gaming chat wheels are extremely worth the 25 US dollars that you have to pay to receive them. I would say, wouldn't you agree? I would agree. Yeah, you don't only get that; you get the uh, the bronze and the silver pack as well included in the bundle when you purchase. Oh my goodness! The, uh... Does that mean that I will receive? Not one, but two Arkosh Gaming loading screens. Yeah, I think there's a few a few good guys in there. A few little, little sprays you can throw down on the ground. Wow, that sounds like the deal for me tonight. Okay. Uh, if you could please be quiet, I'm going to go ahead and tell you what his thought process is, because clearly you don't have any okay. insight. So here it is. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Everybody's bot. I got to get out of here. I'm Sniper. I'm within a few screens of them. I'm about to die. But I could get in on some good action here. Dyer's I'll go ahead and pop out a few shrapnels from the trees. <laughs> and then TP. <laughs> like, he even two shrapnels and immediately TPs knowing how pathetically vulnerable he is. <laughs> and dies anyway. Like, I don't think that he could have played that any better from those trees. I think that would have been impossible. And yet, still, he's caught. No hope. Yeah. Smoke in vision yeah, really there. Good. That's probably Radiant's really good. Oh, really shows up. Oh head. yeah, that's nice. that smoke. You know, everybody feels uh, comfortable in the day, looking across the river. There's nothing there. But what you don't see 
is a little that. gremlin hiding in the shadows, ready to go, ready to get you. They're spaghettiing pretty hard. I think the chaos is definitely throwing them off in this game. <laughs> oh, that's a really good mistook. <laughs> oh my god. Very Obviously, good. it's a really good bait, though, because they're about to all get out of position. Yeah. That was, def that was definitely the intent of that, I think, is just I think so, yeah. bait hard. Oh, yeah. Sniper's laughing again? Why? Oh, I don't see any chat. Yeah, what was know. he doing bored that he's laughing? He's actually walking there, just watching and enjoying it. Oh, there he goes. Yeah, okay. he wasn't moving his mouse. He's clearly typing there. It's like he pre-shrapnels. He trusts the punch is going to hit the hook. Nice. Really good. If there's, if there's one Big thing, sense, I think, man. that we can learn from this replay, it's that Bubbies trust Bubbies. Uh, we'll go ahead and watch that one in slow-mo and actually see how slowly the reaction... <laughs> <laughs> that was so much time. Oh, oh that's pathetic. Oh, what? this is really... Sp I saw this. Uh, they know that the assassinate can actually cancel any sort of uh, TP attempt here, so he just keeps canceling it. Yeah, I do believe also another issue is the total lack of mana from Drow and inability to TP after showing on the wave. But uh, it's really nice right, play right. from Crow, though, to like, if he got a mango on a courier, he would or not switch have... Treads, right? Or switched his treads. Looks like they uh, left him there for the pudge to flesh too. That was a really good call. Yeah, that definitely was. People think that's BM. Someone to make that call. Yeah, people think that's BM, but I think that was just a really good heads up call. It's by not a BM. Crow, it's obviously it's understanding. Obviously, Crow would be calling it. Of course, because Gremlin probably doesn't talk that much. I could say he's a Gremlin, but uh, it's yeah. It's there's no BM. There's no BM going. God, that was such a nice hook. There's no way he dies here, dude. There's no way. How? No, I He's think got uh, I think if people were well, I think if people were inexperienced and they didn't know better, like they're not used to playing with Pudge, uh, they would think that Pudge is going down and they'd probably walk away. But obviously, Chrome Grumble, they're really, really experienced with this Pudge Sniper combo. Yeah. So they would obviously be calling like, you know, I'm not actually dead. Turn, turn, turn. Yeah. Something like that. Yeah, for sure. And uh, Shaggy or uh, who's that? <laughs> What's that guy's name? Doctor, Doctor Gemlo and Canis purchased the Arkosh bundle. It seems like they have it, or is it included? Uh, no, I don't think Valve actually helps out anyone. Shaggy, uh, yeah, from Scooby Doo, dude. Themselves. Relax, relax. Not hi, Shaggy. Wait, Shaggy? Wait, what? Who said Shaggy? Somebody in chat said Shaggy. I didn't say Shaggy. Shaggy. Somebody in chat said Shaggy. Do I mean Canis Vulpus? I didn't. I said Canis Vulpus. Shaggy. You guys are. I don't know what you're. On about. I said Canis Vulp. Shaggy. Yes. New Sham can confirm. Radiant are scanning. New Sham can confirm. Okay, guys. I said I said Canis Vulp. Shaggy. Uh, good action going on bot. Of course, uh... uh he's laughing again. I heard him okay. laugh. I heard him laugh. Okay, that was bullshit. That was bullshit. Check this one out. You seem really invested. The though. hero. You... No, I'm not. The hero model should be big enough. Okay, that's fucking bullshit, Val. The hero model is bigger than the creeps. That was a hit. That was a hit. That was some server tick shit issues right there. That was a glitch. That was a hit. I'm sorry, guys. Okay. Uh, looks like they're taking a fight. Yes, of Crow course. Grimlar late to the party as usual. Ah, that's a classic. Uh, the really high skill assassin comes in on Tiny, obviously. The save comes uh, out. Not right there. What is that? Okay, so how come the so the I... arena like hits? Flash, we'll, we'll, but doesn't... we'll watch this in slow motion. So we have the spear, which of course is one ability oh, that's moving courier. someone. Very good. Yeah. Uh, of course, off of that Runs we have the right boat, the punch. X coming out. Okay. Lesh gets hooked. Hits the wall, stops, and then immediately teleports back. Uh, Mars, I guess, moved away and then got X torrented. Okay, very interesting. Lots of moving around, that's for sure. Yeah, that was a really high skill fight from Arkosh, actually. Oh, looks like Pudge. Okay, very Radiant good. Structures are fortified. Oh, sniper slamming. Okay. Why did they give up? There was so much more action to be had. There was a lot of good action. They were about to get into the axe combo. Come right, on. Right. Oh, man. That was really good, not lazy content. Oh, fuck. That was yeah. Good. If you guys want to see more of that action, uh, go ahead and check out bsj69 at youtube.com for more of that action.
Thank you so much for watching, guys. And we hope to see you in, an, in, an, in another... What? Okay, yeah. let, me, let me tell you guys a story about BSJ right now as we're watching nothing happen, okay? I met BSJ at TI7 in an elevator. Yeah, and scanning. what he did portrayed so much alpha energy to me that I was I was physically erotic. It was it was of a sexual nature for me. Gets in the elevator, me and him, pulls down his pants, defecates creamy diarrhea on the floor. And then he wipes with his right hand, pulls his pants up, puts his right hand on my shoulder, and then says, You did that, Jenkins. And the, the lifelessness in his eyes, the soullessness in his eyes, I was mortified. And then the elevator opens, and a bunch of players are there. 1437 can actually confirm this. Some players come in, and I said, I did that. I shit my pants. I had diarrhea.